And then we'll do this. Yep, okay. Um, we need some more of these. That, I think. And, um, do this. We will have to change some of these offsets. Yeah, it should be fine. Ah, ah welcome back. Hopefully, maybe. Can you hear me? Hello? Hello? Maybe? Probably not. Nope. <laughs> uh. Okay, processed copper. Excellent. Ah, we're we're missing water. I never hooked up the water. No, oh, no real surprise there. This guy's gonna have to move. You do that. Um. Actually, this. And we have to figure out how to get this pipe out of here. Um, we need more underground pipe. Really should switch to the steel underground pipe. There's gonna be a lot of trees in the way. Get out of here, trees. Nobody likes you. Oh, well, I screwed that up. Need one of these. I'm just gonna start there, but it's not gonna stay there. All 
All right, where's our offshore pump that I just made? On the toolbar. And water. I'd like to get these red circuits going before we uh, call it a night. Hey, look. Tinned copper wire. Lots of it. Oh, we should do this. That's that's gonna be important. Um. All right. Well, let's walk this back and see where. We actually um. Okay, I need to slightly adjust. this so that we have room to actually get across um so why don't we just uh that should be fine And we'll just uh, run this back. Hello! Are you actually here? Hello? I don't know that he's here. <laughs> I'm going to run out of belt. That is a guarantee. And out of belt, basically. Oh, no, I'm not out of belt. What the hell? That was weird. Nope, not out of belt. Not going to run out of belt. I have lots of belt. All right, well, there is our tinned copper, or tinned wire coil, tin wire coil, whatever stuff. Man, like, this warehouse of tin has just become, like, obsolete. <laughs> oh, well. <laughs> Hello! Nope. Okay. Well, sort of. Well, Really... I'm gonna guess it auto reconnected him. Maybe? I don't know. Alright, well, there's a tin copper wire. Um, we need carbon in two places here, here, and here. So let's bring that down. Maybe. I don't have any splitters. All 
All right, so there is our car bin. That is not compressed. We can probably fix that, but for the moment, it really just doesn't matter. Um... There's two ways to handle our tinned copper wire. We can bring one line down the middle here and put two machines that push stuff this way. We don't really want to build manufacture stuff up here. Um, the other option is I can bring one line down here and have two machines that uh, push stuff up here, which I think is probably a better idea. So let's do that. Uh, we'll shoot for here. All right, so we're going to walk this back up this way. Hello? Hello? Nope. He, he keeps connecting. I don't know if you guys can hear that or not, but... Uh, he definitely keeps connecting and then disconnecting. I think that, that sounded a lot like he was on uh, hold with uh, his ISP. <laughs> okay, so we'll just bring this down. Uh, we're going to need machines. Um, that's not quite right. Two machines. Do this. And, uh, we'll do... Two is enough. So let's uh, set this up. Grab there, place there. That should work like that, and then this guy can just come over here and go up like this. So if we go down here, oh, uh, we should do this as well. All right, and there is that, and we're going to put this on the bus, which is going to be a little obnoxious. 
Grab some iron. And some gears. We can just make some belt here. Uh, just going to come across this way. I don't know that it's entirely necessary to bring this stuff back to the beginning of the bus, but I do kind of like putting everything on the bus at the beginning if it's possible, because um, that uh, with the way we're doing things, it kind of lets you have all of your materials in one place if you just need to grab stuff for your inventory. Hello and uh, welcome to the stream. Um, we're actually wrapping up here soon i think we've been going for a while and uh and uh um the person i'm playing co-op with internet died again so <laughs> um but uh we're gonna get these red circuits on the bus before we do All right, and I'll probably fix the compression on I'll probably fix the compression on um, this tin copper wire as well because it's gonna annoy me. There's that. We're just racing the circuits. Oh, there's a rock in our way. Okay, that's slow. Oh, I'm out of the uh, pickaxe. Would explain a lot. That'll do that. Uh, let's go fix this compression. Um, let's make a couple more of these. Two ways to fix the compression. We can put down some red belt, or um, the easier way is um, I just using these guys. Hang on, I need to make a pickaxe. There we go. Compression fixed. Now I do not need to be annoyed anymore. Although I do have all this garbage in my inventory I definitely don't want. Yo! And we're filling a red chest with um, red circuits. This is not quite oh same problem as our um, I see what's going on here. Back these up. Um. the same problem I had earlier with um, the the solder. It just wasn't cooperating because of the way that splitters function. That should solve that.
There we go. Excellent. Um, everything's running. And it looks like we're getting a almost compressed belt. I don't know what the holdup is. Probably just like the speed of these machines, I would guess. Oh no, no, it's compressed now. It just needed a second. There we go. Although it probably won't stay compressed because uh, this is not like these 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 setups here. They um, because this needs to be a red belt of copper. Well, I play lots of angels and bobs. Uh, it's pretty much all I'm streaming right now. Um, we've got two different saves going on. This is. Um, this is a save that we're doing, that we're po we're cutting up and posting the VODs on YouTube. Um, but I've also got another save, which I'm further ahead than this, to kind of give myself an idea of what we're, we're doing here. Um, but, uh, yeah. So, anyways, what I was saying was, um, this doesn't quite work, because I need to upgrade this copper line and this, this junction here. Well, actually, I need to upgrade this and then this splitter and put a splitter back here um, to red splitters. Uh, same thing down here, but we're probably never going to use just a full um, yellow belt worth of these circuits. Honestly, it's the same thing with the red circuits, too. Um, we're going to use a lot of that stuff, but we're not going to ever probably use that much. Um... Especially since we're playing with, like, we don't have to worry about laser turrets, really, or anything like that. Because I hate aliens, so they're on easy mode. Um, they're basically just a nuisance. I should have just turned them off entirely, but... I did not. Um, yeah, so we've got that going. Um, so the next thing that we need to do... Uh, we're probably not going to do that tonight. Um, is we need to push our bus a little bit further and actually start manufacturing some of the stuff we're using constantly. Um, like assembly machines and inserters and belt and loaders. Um, we need train stuff in a bad way. Because all of our resources are kind of far away. Um... Yeah. The other thing we need to do is we need to start turning um, all of this stone here, which is backing up now, into landfill because our bus is going to run into a lake. So, um, we'll be doing that next time. Um... Normally, I would say we'll be back on Thursday, but Thursday is Thanksgiving, so I kind of doubt that's going to happen. Um, maybe Friday instead. Maybe tomorrow night, but it's hard to say. I might have some stuff I have to do for Thanksgiving. Um, but, uh, so, normal schedule is Sunday, Tuesday, Thursday, plus whenever I feel like it. Um, but, uh, so, we'll probably be back on, I think, Friday, maybe. Um, thanks for watching. Um, if, if, if you enjoyed it, click follow. I'd appreciate it. And uh, we'll see you next time. Bye.